Hey, um, my name's Shauna, and we live outside here. We are fellow together. <laughs> um, we're doing our presentation on enterprise fleet management. This um, company is a subsidiary of Enterprise Rent-A-Car. Um, enterprise is one of the nation's leading um, fleet management companies, um, and they are um, they provide um, vehicles and fleet management programs for um, companies. Um, they specialize in everything from um, buying or buying selling cars. They sell the cars and um, the fleet management programs, and then the disposal disposal of the cars as well. Um, their ideal customer would be contracting companies such as landscaping co or construction companies that have um, uh, multiple um, vehicles in their fleet. Another um, characteristic they they like to have is dispersed fleets, where their fleets um, are all over the country. Um, the more offices they have, the better. Um, and um, min or they rather have 20 plus fleets or vehicles in their fleet. Okay, um, our buyer today is going to be APS Technology Group. Um, they are specialty contractors <coughs> specializing in the installation of um, optical characteristic recognition, and they have offices around the country um, in multiple <coughs> cities, and they have already made initial contact over the phone. Nice to meet you, David. Come on, have a seat. Sit down, and you can call me Shauna. Okay, Shauna. Um, I know we talked about this earlier in the week, but can we get started with uh, just a brief summary of your uh, vehicle fleet? Okay, sure. We have 22 vehicles located in San Diego, Long Beach, Oakland, Seattle, and North Carolina. Okay. And, uh, oh, sorry. It's okay. No. <laughs> All of our, um, we have a range of full-size trucks, mid-size trucks, and economy cars. All of our technicians drive the, the trucks for maintenance and service and installation, and the sales um, salesman drives the cars for us. Okay, and uh, where do you purchase these cars? We purchase all of our cars from um, a local dealership. We've been using um, them for years, and we know the salesman really well. Okay, and uh, how do you purchase these? We have a $250,000 credit um, line for um, a four-year term at GMAC. Okay. And uh, can you uh, talk a little bit about your uh, fleet management program? We don't have a, ma a management program. Okay. Can you elaborate a little bit more? Well, we deal with maintenance as it comes. We don't have a specific procedure um, when a truck needs maintenance or service. The technician is responsible for dealing with it. Okay. And do you think it's a problem that uh, the technicians are experiencing a lot of downtime with this? Well, we definitely, they don't experience, they don't um, receive repairs when they should. Um, a lot of the time it ends up being more costly when um, they eventually do receive maintenance on the truck. Okay. So it, it, it has become a problem. Okay. And um, do you think this is the most efficient way to run your business? Probably not. Um, it seems to be more costly, um, but... It was easier when we were a smaller company, but now our company has expanded. Okay. So the increase in vehicles has caused for more uh, problems with the company? Definitely. We have more paperwork, more interruptions, and um, more costly service when the, the work does actually get done on the truck. Okay. So if I were to show you a way to uh, decrease the amount of downtime of your technicians and vehicles, would you be interested? Oh, definitely. We're always looking for new ways to streamline our our um, business. Okay. And also, if I could show you a way to simplify your acquisition plan and uh, improve your maintenance program, uh, would you uh, like to look into that? Definitely. Okay. Well, let's get started then. Uh, one of our main benefits here is um, our acquisition program. Um, since we deal directly with manufacturers, there's no dealer fees. Um, this is some of our testimonials from our customers. Uh, you could read that over. Um, it's a lot more simple process. It's a lot more power to the uh, to the buyer, to the customer, to you. Um, and we do have a large uh, network of dealerships around the nation, so um, it's not a problem to get a vehicle to any place, uh, any one of uh, your branches either. 
Um, can you see how this is an advantage from uh, buying from the dealer? Oh, definitely. Okay. And um, also, um, our business <coughs> program is a huge benefit to a uh, to business. Um, not only um, will it save time, but it will improve, improve your uh, company efficiency. Um, it will give your um, um, less headaches to your management so they won't have to deal with it. Um, can you see how this would uh, improve the efficiency of the company? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, this is just like a little, this is a little sheet with the maintenance time uh, with and without it. You can kind of look this over as well. Okay. Um, and I'll, these times mm -hmm. are with, with the fleet management program? Uh, these times are with without the fleet management. So this okay. would be your current situation and this would be like with us with the fleet management service. So you can just see the improvement by switching over. Okay. Um, I'll just give you an example. Um, uh, let's say uh, one of your vehicles in North Carolina needs a new transmission. Um, I mean, it's going to be a little bit harder without a fleet management service to call, um, get estimate costs, um, approve the cost, and um, find a quality mechanic to service your vehicle. Is this something that you can relate to? Well, we haven't had too many problems with maintenance outside of San Diego, but we definitely have a huge problem with um, our local fleet. Okay, well, I'm glad you kind of could uh, see what I'm talking about. Um, I mean, something that was simple, like a transmission for a local car, is um, not a problem, but when it's across the country, a lot more uh, like problems will arise. Um, just with getting it serviced in a timely manner, and, um, and since uh, Enterprise will uh, take charge of all the repairs, um, this will eliminate some of the downtime that your employee will, will incur from this too. Uh, can you see how this will help and benefit your company in terms of downtime to your technician? Definitely. Okay. All right. Um, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, this is a little value analysis that we put together as well. Um, this will be a little bit more how you save money. Um, this is for the 2500 Silverado long bed. Um, this is uh, monthly lease for the 48 months. It's uh, $19 cheaper a month, but when you uh, include that throughout the 48 months, it's a savings of $912. Um, I know uh, it doesn't seem like a lot monthly, but when you put it all together, it's quite a, quite a sum. And not only are you receiving less cost, um, you will be receiving these management um, issues such as uh, uh, the maintenance program, uh, gas programs as well for all your employees to use, uh, insurance as well. And can you can you understand these numbers a little bit? Yeah, they make sense. Okay. And if you were to purchase like six vehicles, it would be saving almost six thousand dollars as well just by switching over to Enterprise okay. instead of the dealership. And are these um extra costs that you're you, you or extra services that you're telling me about, are they included in the the savings? Yeah, they're all included. Um, the only difference, I mean, the, the only saving money, you're receiving all these extra services for free. There's no extra cost for that. Okay. Um, I know one of the problems that a lot of people have is switching over to us. Um, when do you think you can have that? Or when do you think you can switch over immediately? Or is there any, anything holding you back? Well, I'm not sure. Um, I don't feel that, you know, we're pretty comfortable with our our salesman that we deal with now. Okay. Um, I don't know if we're ready to ready to change and have a new relationship. Yeah, I mean, th that's something that a lot of people have. Um, a lot of people are, um, that they like their current salesman that they, uh, that they have been doing business with for years. But I think once you see how Enterprise will benefit your company, you'll um, definitely be um, more willing to switch to that in the long run. Okay, I understand the benefit of, you know, going with Enterprise, but how do I know that I can trust to get a hold of you when I need to purchase the vehicle? Um, well, with Enterprise, um, well, like communications, one of your questions then is just contacting me. Yeah, Enterprise is an awfully big company. How do I know I'm not going to get lost in the mix? Okay, all right, I'm glad we cleared that up. Um, yeah, well, a lot, all of our uh, agents uh, are taught customer relationship management. So throughout the whole selling process, we want the customer to feel comfortable, and um, we just want to establish open lines of communication with them. Um, that's our
our main uh, priority with um, existing customers is just to keep an open table and uh, questions regardless. And uh, we know how important it is to get to be able to have your company run efficiently. And how do I? One of my other concerns is that I will be taking on more work. How do I know that this isn't going to add more work to my job? Okay. Um, well, all these value-added uh, management uh, categories are made to provide less work for you. Um, like we do have a consolidated billing program. So no matter where in the world, or in the nation, I should say, uh, your vehicle is service, it will be under one billing program. So it will save a lot of hassle to your, uh, to your accounting department especially. And uh, just finding a repair shop, um, that will save a lot of time uh, for your management to spend on regular company operations. Tell me, how, tell me about how your um, company will help me purchase um, verifiable green, greenhouse gas emission offset through a third-party partner. Um, well, we do have a green program. Um, this is, uh, we just started with the Going Green campaign that a lot of people have been implementing. Uh, we do have a line of vehicles that will still satisfy your needs, but will be more efficient in gas gas mileage and gas consumption. Okay. And how will you help me analyze options to balance or mitigate emissions by measuring the carbon footprint of individual vehicles in a company's fleet? Well, we keep track of mileage um, just for uh, maintenance issues. Um, we do we keep track of like week by week how many miles you go just to estimate costs and to uh, figure out when you're going to need these maintenance or when the schedule should be uh, used. And with that, we can see by the, like, the miles per gallon how much output of uh, carbon you're using. So if there is, if for like a company ceilings uh, for um, emissions, we can regulate that to where uh, we can have a certain car more gas efficient so that you can still fall under the, uh, the carbon emission that you have. OK. Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. Um, so is, is the risk of going into a, is it more important to uh, engage in our service than it is to uh, keep your existing uh, relationship with the dealership? Well, I'm sure not, I'm still not sure that we should go with Enterprise. Okay. Um, well, there must be something else on, on your mind when you ask what it is. Well, I'm just not sure how we're going to fund these vehicles. Okay, like what sort of problems are you uh, thinking about? Well, we're a growing company. I'm just not sure that this is where we need to allocate our, our funds for the future. Okay. Well, this is actually a problem that a lot of uh, new businesses um, convey to us. We actually have a lease program that is satisfies uh, small businesses like yours that are in the expansion phase. Um, this is a little graph of what the finance looks like here. Uh, what we do is instead of paying the full purchase price up front or just having a, uh, a lease program, we have an open lease proactive plan. So what that does is it takes the resale value into uh, consideration and minuses that from the overall cost. Uh, so you can see here the full cost is 21000 resale 5000 So instead of paying 16000 up front, you would be paying that every year. So for the four years of the 48 months, you'd be paying or $4,000 each year. So that will keep more funds uh, in your company for uh, later use or in a, a predicted problem that might arise. Okay. Okay, is there any other questions that you have? No, I think you've answered them. Okay. Uh, if I can just get you to sign here. Did, did you want three or six trucks? Um, I think we'll go with three. Okay, perfect. I think once you uh, see how Enterprise will be uh, benefiting your company, you really see uh, that this is a great opportunity for you. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you.